Your workflows will change and grow with your business. When the time comes to make an update at the template level, the most important thing to know is that the workflow templates and workflow copies are disconnected from each other. Adjusting the master template of a workflow you've been using for a while will not automatically update all of the projects where that workflow template is currently applied. There is an option at the bottom of the template to update project workflows, but it may not work the way you're hoping. Pressing this button will automatically push updates to all copies of that template inside their respective projects. However, in some circumstances, an email could go out to a current client that's out of sync with where you actually are in their project. You will not be able to review which updates will be applied beforehand and the changes are irreversible. For this reason, we recommend that you allow new workflow changes to trickle in slowly instead of trying to update all your workflows already in progress. That means that after you make changes to the workflow template, the changes should take effect the next time the workflow gets applied to a brand new project or a start a workflow action. Projects with existing workflows should run their course without updates. Here's a tip. If you do need to update a workflow that's currently running, the safest way is to edit an individual action directly on the workflow inside the project. If you update a canned email template that's also being used somewhere in a workflow template, you'll need to go into the workflow template to pull in the latest version of the canned email. It will not update automatically. Here's a tip. As you're working in your account, anywhere that you've connected a canned email template and you can see the entire email populated, a copy has been made from the template. If you make changes to the original canned email, you will need to reselect that template to pull in the most recent version. For contracts, subagreements, questionnaires, and proposals, if you make an update to the individual template, the next time a workflow that includes that template gets applied in a project, it will pull the most recent version of the content. Because forms get copied into the project immediately after the workflow is applied, the content in older projects will not get updated automatically if you make a change on the master content template. There is one exception to this rule. If you're using the workflow to send a contract by itself, not as part of a proposal contract and invoice, the contract will be applied to the project when the action runs, not immediately when the workflow is applied. Similar to form templates, if you update a payment schedule template, the next time the workflow using that payment schedule template gets applied in a project, it will pull the most recent version of the payment schedule. If you update a scheduler template, the next time a workflow action runs that uses that specific template, it will pull the most recent version of the scheduler. And similar to the scheduler templates, a workflow action that starts a new workflow will pull the most recent workflow template available at the time the action is triggered.